Hello dear members and welcome to another edition of HJ Global News. The events marking the 61st anniversary of True Parents Holy Wedding have been successfully held in this new spring of the establishment of Chonegok. In this edition of HJ Global News, we will look back at images of the Rally of Hope marking the launch of the Think Tank 2022 panel, as well as the victory celebration which was held in an atmosphere of joy and happiness. On May 9th, the sixth Rally of Hope for the realization of a heavily unified Korea was held, marking the launch of the International Group of Experts, Think Tank 2022. The event was broadcast live on PeaceLink, social network and national TV channels. It registered a total of over 1.7 billion views. The theme of the conference was Peaceful Reunification of the Korean Peninsula and the Realization of a Sustainable and Peaceful World. From the beginning, the Think Tank 2022 출범, 희망전진 대회를 여러분들의 뜨거운 박수로 시작하도록 하겠습니다. <웃음> Through the last five rallies of hope, True Mother has revealed the secrets of heaven that could end humanity's unfortunate history. In particular, she presented the vision of a heavily unified Korea to leaders from around the world, affirming that the prerequisite for a heavily unified world, where all mankind stands as one great human family united under God, is the peaceful unification of the Korean Peninsula, the only nation still divided in the world. Under the leadership of UPF International and its six affiliated organizations, we officially held the official launch of Think Tank 2022, an international think tank made up of 1,011 Korean and 1,011 other experts from around the world in the fields of politics, economic, religion, diplomacy and security. In his welcome address, Ban Ki-moon, former UN Secretary General, welcomed the establishment of the Think Tank 2022 panel and called for increased international cooperation to bring about peace on the Korean Peninsula. What makes this event more special are the distinguished participants comprised of global leaders and experts representing diverse sectors. United in the shared commitment to paving a path toward the peace on the Korean Peninsula over the course of the next 18 months, Think Tank 22 will create vital change and serve as a stepping stone for peaceful Korean Peninsula. This was followed by speeches from prominent world leaders including Yud Kridrish, Chong se -kyun, Mike Pence, President of Zanzibar Hussein A. Mwinwi, and renowned investor Jim Rogers. They discussed topics from various fields in order to formulate an agenda for the realization of a heavily unified Korea. There were also congratulatory messages from the President of Kosovo, Shosa Osmani, and several Korean political leaders. Afterwards, Little Angels and Korean artist Kim Dok Su highlighted the spirit and the soul of the Korean people through artistic performances reflecting the culture of heart and the ideal world so desired by all. After the arrival of flag bearers, True Mother took the stage for the official launch of Think Tank 2022. At the International Leadership Conference, which was held online across continents from April 28 to May 1, participants adopted the Think Tank 2022 resolution. True Mother then put her final signature on the resolution and struck the peace gong to mark the official launch of this panel that will work for 18 months. 2022 experts from various fields around the world will participate in regular webinars to develop concrete policies for the realization of a heavily unified Korea. Their efforts will thus form the cornerstone of the Asia-Pacific civilization which will mark the beginning of a heavily unified world. 
The victory celebration of the events marking the 61st anniversary of True Parents' Holy Wedding was held on May 10th at the Chongqing Peace World Center. These events, which were all successful, began on March 27 with the Hyojong Youth Blessing Festival and concluded on May 9th with the Rally of Hope, marking the launch of Think Tank 2022. This victory celebration began with the Hundoke led by John Wonju McDavid. Among other things, she read True Mother's Blessing Prayer, highlighting the victory of the seven year cosmic course that led to the Cheonegook's establishment day. 7년 노정을 통해 하늘 부모님을 지상에 모시기 위한 환경권을 만들기 위하여 나라와 각계 종단과 대륙을 축복하는 자리까지 나아가 2020년에 천일국 안착을 선포하였습니다. 이 얼마나 하늘이 고대하고 인류가 고대하던 날임을 섭리를 아는 축복 가정들은 압니다. Afterwards, Dr. Yoon Yong-ho, director of international headquarters, gave a special report on the various events held during 44 days. He spoke of True Mother's immense love and devotion, who gave clear guidance for the success of each event. His report rallied the determination of all participants. We have to be here Sumni the true mother of mankind, the victorious queen of Chonagok, then entered the room. After receiving heartfelt greetings from members around the world, true mother who looked her best revealed to everyone the attitude that the chosen people should have in this new era. Sadaganan. 전 세계 지도자 식구 여러분 너무도 반갑고 사랑합니다. 우리는 기필코 하늘 부모님 앞에 맹세한 그 뜻을 이루어 드릴 수 있다 하는 자신을 갖게 되었습니다. 그렇습니까? 다시 오마한 그 한날을 기다리면서 2000년간 나왔던 기독교를 참 부모로서 다시금 목적지가 어디이고 어떻게 살아야 한다. 지상 생활을 하고 있는 동안에 하늘 부모님을 모시는 삶을 살아야 하는데 참 부모의 부름을 참 부모의 말씀에 귀를 기울이고 다 같이 축복 받을 수 있는 자리로 나아가기를 바라는 마음에서 새 시대에는 새로운 옷으로 단장해야 돼요. 성경에도 새 수술은 새 부대에 담아라 했어요. 그러니 기독교인들이 눈이 트이고 귀가 열리고 그래서 참 부모 섭리에 동참하여 다 함께 축복 받을 수 있는 기회를 만들어 주자. 그래서 인류의 3분의 1이라도 그 이상이 하늘 부모님을 알고 지상에서 모시는 삶을 살수 있도록 인도하는 
여러분 세계 지도자 축복 가정 모두가 되기를 바라서 말씀했습니다. 기원절 선포 이후에 7년 노정을 걸어오면서 참 누구도 이해할 수 없고 힘든 노정이었음은 다 알고 있을 것입니다. 그러나 여러분들의 수고와 정성이 나와 하나 돼서 하늘에 축복을 받는 자리 하늘을 모실 수 있는 환경권을 만들었다는 것 이거 대단한 축복이며 우리들의 행복입니다. 그래서 나는 2023년은 물론이요. 2027년까지 여러분들이 더욱더 분발 노력하여 세계 인류를 다 품을 수 있는 환경권을 만들 수 있는 그날을 향해서 전진하기를 바랍니다. 이번 이런 어, 대회가 있기까지 본부를 중심 삼은 모든 기관들이 하나가 돼서 이러한 결과를 만들어냈습니다. 행복합니다 나는. 그래서 2027년 그 하늘 부모님의 날을 맞는 그날을 향해서 전진합시다. 승리합시다. 이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이이